Talk to me about Starship. I think Starship is central to what we're going to do next. Free-floating space stations, the moon, Mars, the asteroids. Starship by itself is amazing, but it's also a catalyst for other things. What are your predictions for its role in settling Mars? If it, we're going to settle Mars in our lifetime, Starship is central. I, I believe that Starship will be reaching orbit on a regular basis by 2024. Now, if that's the case, if that's the reality we're living in in the year 2024, 100 tons to orbit being delivered by a vehicle with 1% the launch cost of a Saturn V. We're going to have an election in 2024. Someone's going to be elected president. He or she is going to turn to his or her advisors and say, wow, this guy wants to go to Mars and he's got this stuff. If we got together with him, could we have people on Mars by the end of my second term? And the answer is going to be, of course. And they say, well, is it going to cost a trillion dollars? No, it could probably be done within NASA's existing budget because He's got the main stuff. He needs a whole bunch of odds and ends. They need surface power. They need surface spacesuits, vehicles, ISRU plants. We could develop that. If we got together with him, this could be done. In other words, by making the mission uh, practical, he's going to make it sellable. 